Hey, what's up guys? Anyang Haseo. I'm coming right back at you with another on-demand uh, Korean lesson for you. In today's short lesson, we are going into my fifth installment in the ongoing series of Basics of Korean. All right, let's hit it. So we want to uh, eventually get to say, being able to say thank you very much. But for now, we're going to learn very much. Very much is Chongmal. Chongmal, give it a try. Chongmal, okay? Now, thank you very much is Chongmal Kasamnida. Chongmal Kasamnida, give it a try. Chongmal Kasamnida. Imagine you are uh, at a restaurant, you want to say uh, thank you very much. Chong, Chongmal Kasamnida. All right, let's learn to say breakfast or also morning uh, will be a chim, a chim. Give it a try, a chim. All right, let's say I don't know. I don't know is going to be mulayo, mulayo. Give it a try. All right, let's learn how to say but. But is going to be hajiman, hajiman. Give it a try. Hajiman. Okay. Let's say a little. A little is going to be chokumyo. Chokumyo. Give it a try. Okay. Chokumyo. All right. Let's say yes. Yes is going to be ajik. Ajik. Give it a try. All right. So let's say I ate lunch. I ate lunch is going to be. Uh, chomshin mogasoyo. Chomshin mogasoyo. So let me break that down for you. Lunch is chomshin. Chomshin, give it a try. And then uh, I ate is going to be mogasoyo. Mogasoyo, give it a try. Okay, so then let's uh, say, have you had lunch? Okay, so again, lunch is chomshin, chomshin, chomshin. Uh, have you had it? Is going to be chusa soyo, chusa soyo. Okay, so instead of moga, which is I ate, we're in we're using chusa, and then the uh, suffix sa soyo, or soyo. Sorry, soyo. Uh, so yo, okay, so Chumshin uh, Moga so yo was I ate lunch. Uh, Chumshin Chusa so yo is have you had lunch? All right, so uh, before we end, let me explain a little bit about the Korean language. Uh, you will change your expression when you talk about yourself because you want to be less polite when you're referencing yourself but more polite when you're referencing somebody else so you want to be more polite to other people less polite to yourself it's like holding the door okay so uh there you have it that is my fifth installment in the ongoing series of basics of the korean language stay tuned for more short lessons in the future yeah. Much longer lessons will be coming soon. To stay up to date on these and get notified when the longer videos will be posted, please like and smash that subscribe button. I look forward to seeing you soon. Have a nice day. This is Teacher Ben. Chongman Kamsamnida. Chongman Kamsamnida.